Welcome to Universal here in Conover, North Carolina. We're um, excited to, to have the factory here and uh, start the upholstery process, which has been going on for the last five years of building married fabric to frame uh, program that has been highly successful for those of you who've tried it. But uh, we're now ready to take it to the next step, which is the special order process. And that's going to happen here in Conover, North Carolina. We've developed a very consistent uh, program between the product we're developing and building in Vietnam and the product that we've developed here in Conover um, so that we feel like it's an, an, a natural step to now take it to the next level in special orders. We have 425 fabrics and 50 leathers, 450,000 square foot factory that we're going to take you through today and uh, show you that upholstery process. So we're excited about it and we're excited to take you through. So now that you've placed the order with Universal, you're now in the fabric storage area. So we receive in uh, fabrics from all over the world into this area we have over 425 covers in the line with over 50 leathers available and they're stored here ready to receive your order in and this is where the process really begins they're received into this area inspected and then uh, then goes to the next phase which is our going to be our sewing and cutting the cover has been cut and now it's being prepared to be sewn we have our, our all of our parts are coming together to be sewn we have our flat work sewers our cushion sewers uh, the entire parts will be sewn together, being uh, prepared to go into the upholstery area. We'll do our sewing of our leather and our fabric in this area. We have approximately 25 sewers doing single needle, double needle, and different types of stitches to accommodate the styles that you have chosen. Here we're assembling our frames. We use uh, seven ply ply wood. In some instances, we're doubling up our, for strength for our spring up. You can see our spring up clips here. Uh, we're attaching uh, shooting staples that are glued. We're glued together as he's shooting these. Uh, these are just uh, uh, blocks that he's putting in the puzzle joint here. It's, a, it's one of the strongest uh, methods of putting a, a frame together because it locks it in and it can't pull out. And so uh, we use state-of-the-art equipment for producing our, our uh, frames and the best technology available as far as uh, designing our frames for uh, strength and durability. Here he's attaching some rails uh, front to back to add additional strength to the piece. You see how tight it is when he's having to drive it in with a hammer to make sure those, uh, those joints are tight. And then he's shooting those in place. The staples do little except hold it while the glue is drying. The glue is where your strength is. So here you've got one of our swivel chairs and just to kind of reinforce or show you know, how strong the frame is, you, know, you have a swivel base on here, but as Dale already mentioned, it's a seven or a five ply laminated um, hardwood that we use here and you know, it's reinforced. Uh, so you've got basically about 21 plies up here in the top, which is a stress point where you're leaning against the back of the chair. Um, the puzzle joinery down here in the base is also uh, reinforced into the arms on the sides and stapled, um, glued in place. And then you've got your spring system that'll go in here and across the top of it. Um, but just to, to kind of give you the overall, the construction of this and um, frame probably weighs nearly 100 pounds and, and uh, is covered with a lifetime warranty. So now that we've gone through a few different phases, this is the staging area of the process where we've gone through the cutting and the sewing and um, all that gets bundled and put together for the product. It's brought together with the frame uh, construction that you've seen uh, out there. It's gone a few extra steps of basically covering the springs and then adding a uh, layer of poly that goes to the front to basically protect uh, the back of your leg as you're sitting in the chair. Then the cushions get brought in and the rest of the poly before it goes to the next process, which is putting the actual casing on it and starting the inside upholstery process, which goes into the next phase of the factory. So this is the main upholstery portion of the factory. You've got the insiders and the trimmers in this particular area. So this is where the process of doing any kind of tufting on the product, actually upholstering the inside of the product as well as the front rails, the exterior of the product. Uh, the legs would get assembled and put onto the product at this point of the process. So it's the main upholstering that gets done here and all takes place in this process of the factory. 
So multiple places throughout the upholstery process will stop and make sure that this is uh, the product that you would expect from Universal. This is one of the uh, inspection stations. Once it's gone through the insiding process, uh, what Miranda is doing here is, is basically feeling all around the rails to make sure that there's um, no loose staples or the frame is, um, is, is uh, sticking through the fabric or going to be any touch point that you as a consumer or a retailer would uh, not like to feel um, and throughout the whole process. So this is all padded and, and she's just feeling for all those, um, those spots. And then if you see that there's some sort of welt that's a little wavy and she can then um, make that stop in the process, send it back to the upholster, make sure that it gets fixed and moves on to the next process beyond that. Here our, our product is complete. We're doing our final inspection process here. Kim is going through and making sure that everything is uh, perfect for the customer. She's putting her tags on. She's checked it out. She's made sure everything meets expectations so that we'll have a happy customer in the end. So at this point, this product is ready to be wrapped and packed and be shipped, to our, shipped out to our customer. So now we've entered into the packaging area. You've seen actually this Barkley Ottoman being manufactured earlier. Uh, throughout this process, they're building boxes for these uh, so that it ships to you uh, in the safest possible way, especially wrapped, overwrapped, being that this is 100% cotton velvet. We'll do a few extra steps to make sure that this arrives to you in the safest possible way. You know, before a frame is, is uh, packaged, we'll do some extra protection to make sure that the uh, legs don't get broken through the process. So these will actually be capped with an extra layer of foam uh, that rides within the box that this is assembled in. So then it is uh, behind you here, you've got a shrink wrap, wrap process that the product is then bagged and then over wrapped with a plastic wrap and shrink wrapped to arrive and ride as safe as possible through the transportation process. So now you've seen the upholstery process. This is our warehouse area where you've got all of our ready to ship product. This is our married fabric to frame product that's ready to go. We'll deliver within 10 days to anywhere in the country and all this product is, is waiting for you to place your orders. Thanks for joining us today on the tour. Um, hope you enjoyed uh, learning and, and seeing more about Universal Upholstery here in Conover, North Carolina. Um, we're really excited to get this program going around mid-June of this year. Um, I think what you can expect to, to see is a consistent quality product with a lifetime warranty, 30 to 45 day delivery on over 425 fabrics and 50 leathers. Um, and we're excited about the program and excited to get it started and uh, we believe this is just the beginning.